Okay, welcome guys. Uh, my name is Vivian and I am uh, with Electrosonic. Today we're going to be unboxing MaxHub's wireless screen share box. Okay, let us see what's in the box. Okay, very nicely packaged. Oh, okay, so here we have the main unit, which is the MaxHub's wireless unit. And what else does it come with? We have a 1.8 meter HDMI cable. We have the power supply. And we have the various power socket fittings for different parts of the country, wherever you are in the world. Okay, that's very nice. Let us now look at the wireless dongle. Okay, that's what it is. Nicely boxed, great packaging. You should keep this and use it um, and keep it safe in here. Okay, that's what's in there. So this is the actual MaxUp wireless screen share box. Okay, we have a little LED indicator light in the front, which will be powered on or off. It'll tell us when it's on or off. Okay, if we look at the back, we've got the following connections and ports. We have your normal on and off or your power button. You have two audio line outs here. You have a normal 3.5 millimeter jack as well as an optical, a fiber optic jack. So you can plug these into sound bars or existing sound systems, okay? You have two USB ports here, 2.0, which allows the following. You can actually use them to pair your dongles with, as well as connecting to touch overlays and creating the touch feedback that you could use. Okay, you have two USB output, uh, sorry, HDMI outputs here. Okay, and then you have your normal DC 12 volt input to power the device, LAN connection to put it up on the network, and then you have um, the locking device, which is similar to the laptops that you would use, and you can plug in a Kingston lock, uh, lock it, put it in there and tie it to the desk or whatever, so it doesn't get legs and walk away. Okay, that's what it is. Now we're gonna look at the wireless dongle that comes with this, so we get two of these that come with it. And this is what it looks like. It's a little USB input into your uh, USB, into your laptop. And then you have a LED indicator ring here that would turn solid once you're ready to connect. Okay, before doing that, we would normally take it and plug it into this device here to pay it. So it's ready to pay with this box and this box only. Let's carry on guys. So now that we're gonna plug this in, we're gonna see and put it three spaces. See if it's ready to plug and play. Firstly, I'm going to plug in the power. Okay, 12 volt DC input power. And then I'm going to plug this and connect it to the, our prospective display through HDMI. And then also, as you would see, we have a touch overlay here with the USB, through USB, which I'm going to now plug in here to this device. So we're going to get some touch feedback when we connect. Okay, and I'm gonna get my colleague Sean over here to switch over. So now we can have a look at the user interface of it. Okay, here we can see the very simple, easy user interface. It tells you what you need to do. You're gonna either scan the QR code, download the software for your mobile devices, Android or Apple devices, as well as if you connect through the MaxUp Share software, Here's your key or your password that you would use connecting it, and that's as simple as that. Now, what we're gonna do is firstly connect our laptop. Okay, first, before we do that, we've gotta pair this dongle with the unit so that it recognizes it and we can share. Okay, we're gonna plug into the USB port. And it'll come up there and tell us that it's now pairing the device. Once it's paired, we'll get something up like this and we are ready to pair the device with our laptop. Now we are on the home page of the interface with the different ways of connecting wirelessly to, through the device to display onto the screen. Firstly, we're gonna scan the QR code with a mobile device. At the moment, I'm using an Apple device. I'm gonna scan this unlock my phone. Scan using the camera. It'll take me to the website and then to the Apple Store where I'm going to download the app. Okay, now that the app's downloaded, let us open the app. 
And for Apple devices, you can connect using uh, through the hotspot. Android, you can scan and go um, connect using the app as well. So here we go. And that's me, quick and easy. Okay. So you can obviously mirror, you can add in photos, and you can add a video. Okay, we're also now going to bring in our my laptop as well. Okay, so I'm going to grab my laptop and plug that in. It will flash and when it's ready, it will have a solid light and tell me, right, you're ready to share. And I'm going to have both my mobile and my laptop display. Okay, there's my laptop. So I get control of my laptop, not my mobile device. Okay, you can see I'm controlling my presentations. Okay, and then I'm going to ask my colleague Sean to bring in his device. He's downloaded the software onto his laptop. And we're going to display that. And that's Sean's uh, computer as well, as you can see here. Got control of his as well. And that. Okay, and then um, Sean, you're going to connect your mobile device so we can fill in the last quadrant here. There we go. So there you see four quadrants, full control of both the laptops, and you can have uh, displays using your mobile devices. Bring your own device. Very quick, very easy. And that is how we connect using MagSub's wireless screen share box. Very quick, very easy. It's all plug and play. Thank you guys very much for joining me. Please be sure to join Agrisonic in more episodes of product engagement. Thank you.